hey hey guys what's up it's been a minute i wanted to make this super quick video to show you my updated everyday routine to start off i use this milk makeup foundation um it is the best foundation i found for my skin i have combination skin so i get dry on the outers of my face but kind of oily in the t-zone so this um, applicator is really cool. It's kind of like a roller ball and you just push the bottom button to kind of dispense the makeup onto the ball. I just rub it all over my face and I use a flat brush like this Morphe one here and I just pretty much pounce it into my skin. So this foundation is like your skin but better which is perfect for that everyday routine. So you can see that it's kind of evened out my skin tone but still kind of given me that glow. So I use this RMCA powder that I got from Amazon a while ago and I just use this Real Tex Techniques brush. I feel like I can never say that word. Technique. Anyway, I use just a little bit on that brush to kind of go over my under eyes, my eyelids, and the creases of my nose. Anything extra that I have on the brush is going to go in the T-zone, and that's just going to kind of keep the foundation in place the whole day. If you've watched my videos before, nothing has changed about my contour and bronzing routine. I'm using my Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette to pick up my two shades there at the end, and what I do with my contouring and bronzing is I dispense the color on my temple and kind of blend up and down from there. So if you put all your color um, from your brush on your temple and blend down to your cheekbones, that will give you a lot of control on where you actually want to blend it. I use my Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer just to bronze up my nose and put a little bit more color back into the center of my face. Plus, this here kind of matches the sunburn that I have going on on my shoulders, so <laughs> it's all good. I'm using the Milani Most Loved Mattes Palette. This is the perfect um, eyeshadow palette for every day. I use any of the six top shades, just kind of depends on what I'm feeling. I'm using the top two shades there in the palette just to kind of create a my skin but better effect on my eyelids. For eyebrows, I'm trying out this new Anastasia Beverly Hills kind of gel brow gel brow no brow gel <laughs> so first i take my own spoolie with no makeup on it and i'll brush through my eyebrows to kind of get the shape i want them to be and then i'll go in with the spoolie from the actual product with the um gel on it and just dispense the color on it like that you know what i mean just brush through your brows with the product right Right. All right, mascara, nothing's changed here. I've used the same mascara in every single video. All right, going in with my favorite lip pencil by NYX in the color Sandstorm. I love using their lip pencils. They're just so creamy and they go on so easily. And to be honest, they're really hydrating, which is perfect for my dry lips. And this is the only lip pencil that I've used that really does last the entire day. On top of that, I'm going in with the NYX Lip Cream in the color London, I believe, just to add a little bit more um, of a nude shade on top. So after that, I think that's going to be the finished look, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Um, let me know in the comments what other looks you want to see, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Thanks again. Bye, guys.